France 24's correspondent Nadine Theron explains. Scientists say the B11529 variant carries an extremely large amount of mutations and it's spreading at a worrisome rate. This is concerning because a new variant could be more transmissible and more resistant to vaccines and the natural immune system. 22 cases of the new variant have been detected in South Africa's most densely populated province of Gauteng and it's been detected in other provinces too, while new cases are still being confirmed. Hospitalizations in the country have increased, but it's uncertain whether the new variant causes milder or more severe disease. Three cases have been detected in the neighboring country of Botswana and one in Hong Kong in someone who has traveled to South Africa. Most cases of the new variants are young people under 25, the least vaccinated age category. Only 35% of South Africa's total population have been fully vaccinated and vaccination rates are dropping, although there's no shortage of vaccines. South African health authorities have said that they're still uncertain what the full significance of the new variant is. But in the meantime, the government here is considering a tightening of COVID-19 lockdown restrictions ahead of the festive season. The National Coronavirus Command Council and the Cabinet are meeting over the weekend to discuss this possibility.